way it felt to be a child, the feeling of salt water on your sunburned legs. Sometimes the water is yellow, sometimes it's red, but what color it may be in memory depends on the day. I'm not going to tell the story the way that it happened. I'm going to tell it the way I remember it.
many different psychological attributes. That, for example, if you had uh, a lot of room up here, you must have some kind of dragon-like uh, manipulativeness or openness to experience. Now, how would how would something like this happen? How could you have a biological basis for something like a delusion or like kind of hallucinations? Um, the sense of reality is grossly disrupted. The ability to tell uh, to tell, to tell uh, what's in your head and what's not in your head is grossly disrupted. Even if there's no contribution to the environment whatsoever, your mind can open up and you lose your ability to tell uh, to tell inside and outside to tell real.
I think, I think what's going on is that it's, it's an inherent, and essentially it's the, it's the universe coming awake to itself. I think that consciousness permeates reality, and what we're seeing is, you know, the, 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 the sentient universe in, in a way, in the process of waking up to us.
Peace. 